So this is a compound, Newham Street Gym. It's a gym that's specifically designed to reduce the impact of youth violence, gangs, serious organized crime, extremist ideologies. Uh, we're located directly outside a school, another school over there, and my old school just down the road. Um, our gym is purpose built, it's focused primarily on those key topics. Um, we're the only street gym in the whole borough of Newham. And uh, we're, we're fully equipped. We've got a, an amazing rig out here so people can do their bars and climb on there. And we've got a fight room. And uh, we have a professional UFC fighter that's been using our gym, uh, Darren the Dentist Stewart, who's flying the flag up high for Great Britain. And he is a professional fighter for the UFC. On that wall, it says, for the people of Newham. And this gym is a not-for-profit business and it belongs to the streets. We've got the, the Hulk on our walls and a She-Hulk as well. Uh, that's a boys' changing room and a women's changing room. And uh, I think that it gives a, a representation of what's inside us. Um, we all have a level of anger and anger is one letter away from danger if you put a D in front of it. So we try to contain it. Um, to contain our, our anger and use our anger for the processes of, of um, training and releasing that frustration and, you know, using it on a punch bag. So we're, we're, we're training and conditioning and focusing our minds uh, for the right reasons as opposed to the wrong reasons. Um, the gym itself, we don't have any machines. It's all for natural body weight training. We've got free weights over there which uh, go up to about 30 kilos. Um, we've got kettlebells, we've got bags. We've got everything that's needed to keep our bodies fit, and strong. And uh, we've got professional athletes that use our gyms. Uh, this gym, this gym itself, um, I wasn't funded. I didn't receive any funding at all. Um, I actually remortgaged my own house to build this gym. And yeah, 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 I've done this for the communities. Um, I, I was um, doing my cars from here quite some time ago and I decided I'm going to change this. I'm going to do something different. Um, so during the first lockdown, I decided because I'm with the university, Middlesex University, I decided to um, turn this place into a, a research facility. You see on the wall, it says, it says uh, COVID-19 research facility. There's a reason behind that. On the floor, you can see the stripes and stuff. If you, if you come with me. So on the floor, you can see these grid boxes. Can you see them? Yep. Okay, so those stripes indicate zones where people can train specifically to reduce the spread of COVID-19 infectious diseases by maintaining a safe distance. So the first safe distance training policy for sports and gyms was created at this very gym. So I'm the creator of the world's first safe distance training policy and guidance for sports and gyms during first lockdown, the first week of lockdown, as a matter of fact. And then um, at the same time, I created the world's first counter extremism policy for sports and gyms to reduce the spread of extremist ideologies embedded within sports. Um, so yeah, there's quite a few bits of work that I've done from this, um, from this, um, this gym. We've helped countless amounts of young people. Um, we serve a purpose and I took all the risk on myself to create this gym and build it so it suits the purpose and needs of the community. 